Hi y'all, so it's evening time. I just got home from work. I'm not exactly home. Literally sitting outside in the car waiting, just waiting. Okay, just waiting. <laughs> Because, like, with the house, I'm just waiting. I just had some patty. Listen, we stopped by Jamaican Flavor or whatever it's called and bought some patties. And gosh, these patties was hitting, honestly. Maybe it's because I was literally starving why they tasted like they tasted so much better. But they were. I can't plug my charger. I need to borrow this charger. I just realized that I'm going to be going in the bus and, like, I'm going to need to charge my phone. But I literally can't plug my charger in the bus because. The way how my charger is set up, the part that you plug in, it's like more, a little bit more complicated. It's a good thing that I thought about it from now because I would have been asked out up on there without my phone being able to charge or whatever. So that's good. Slip the charger in my pocket. But um, yeah, um, I'm waiting. Right now it's pretty much five o'clock and like I'm not gonna get home until maybe like after nine. But I also need to swing by my friend to drop off a his birthday gift that I bought him because he's having a party Saturday and I'm not gonna be going because I had made other arrangements to go to a barbecue. So I'm not gonna be going to his party, but I need to like drop off his gift today. And um, yeah, today was a pretty good day at work. And I just went by the, 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 the nail salon too because I was gonna get my nails done. But when I went in there, all the time when you go, they wanna ask if you wanna do a pedicure. No, just my nails. I just need some gel acrylic that's all and they just had me there sitting for a while and i'm just like you know i like i'll just go back tomorrow morning first thing in the morning and get it done because i'm off tomorrow that just means that like all my errands are pushed back to tomorrow even though like i literally don't have to do my laundry tomorrow i just need to go on the avenue tomorrow so i can buy some more scrubs even though i do have scrubs but like i wanted to like that's one of the errands that i wanted to run to but um yes i'm gonna have to do that tomorrow but right now i'm just sitting down waiting Oh, I'm kind of tired, but I'm literally going to sleep on this bus because I'm riding this bus to, to the city and um, yeah, so it's going to be a good little ride where I can literally sleep and the seats recline. So that's fun. Hi y'all, so I have my hair tied up because I just maybe 45 minutes ago scheduled a nail appointment with this Guyanese girl that had come to retail one day said she just relocated from like Guyana. Is it Guyana or Trinidad? I forgot she just relocated however and she does nails and I asked her if she had an Instagram and she showed me and at this point I met her probably three weeks ago the last time when I was gonna get my nails done I was thinking about scheduling with her but I was feeling really lazy and didn't feel like I wanted to go out of my way to like go all the way down on the avenue to go get that done so I ended up going by the Chinese again because I felt like it was more convenient however I tried the SNS it was okay, but it was my favorite. They broke, literally have no nails on right now. So I decided to schedule with the girl because one thing about Caribbean people, if you want French tips, they will do the white with the white powder, do the pink with the pink powder. You know, you will get what you want, pretty much. So um, I'm gonna try her today. What I wanted, I messaged her and asked her how much it would cost. She said it would cost $40, so that's fun. I always end up leaving the Chinese shop paying more than that. And most times still not get what I wanted. So we're gonna try her today. So I need to make sure that I have them for dollars. I know I have cash because I dropped some cash yesterday, but this little excursion that I was going on yesterday that I spoke about. Um okay. I have forty dollars. That didn't even end up working out because we had some difficulties along the way we're not gonna get into that but i also wanted to go into is it burlington burlington and somewhere else i can't remember where so i'm just wearing this little top here and like some shorts because probably hot as hell do i want to wear some slides or do I want to wear a slip on? Maybe I want to wear a slip on because I will be damned if I have dirt tracking on like the back of my foot on the big avenue. 
not so cute. But um, yeah, I really think that I'm gonna have a good experience with her because obviously she's Caribbean and she knows what she's doing. Also, she has an Instagram, so I was looking at her work on Instagram. Maybe I'll change the top. This top is a little big. This is probably better paired with. I was looking at her work on Instagram and it looks pretty good. So her internet presence is really good. So I feel like that stands for something. So I'm very excited about that. So I'm gonna make my way down there from like a little bit early and then like go into like one or two of the stores that I actually wanna go in. And hopefully by the time I'm done, I just make my way to her. Cause she's like right in the middle of everything or depending on the time that I get there, I like go to her and then go to the store I wanna go to. Afterwards, I don't know. We have to see how it goes, but however it works, that's what I'm doing. I changed the tempered glass on my phone too because that joint was broken for a while. I don't know which one of these little bags I'm gonna take with me. I definitely need to bring my reusable shopping bag. Maybe I should just throw everything in there and just bring the one bag because I need to take my breath control. Today is. She's also working from like her house because what she had expressed was that she just relocated here so like she doesn't have a shop or whatever so I'm hoping that's like a positive experience for me because that's not really my favorite thing going into somebody's house because mm -mm, I know how I keep my house and you know I don't know however I'm hoping that it's a positive experience for me but that's what we're doing today okay so I guess I'm taking the other one then because you can't even hold it in my bag I should just throw everything in my reasonable bag and bring that on me I come back to do that real quick and come back home and like should be good for the rest of the day. I didn't even eat anything, so hopefully I'm not starving at this little appointment. So I'm gonna keep my hair tied so like it's leaned on when I'm done. But yeah. Today I had so many other things lined up to do, like I had laundry to do, but I could do that tomorrow evening when I come home. I wanna buy some scrubs, so I need to I need a little to-do list. That's one of the reasons why I decided to just schedule the appointment with her too. Because I know that I wanted to buy some scrubs on the avenue. To-do list. Um, nails. Nail appointment. Scrubs. Shirt. For the barbecue. Maybe that was all. Oh, these little shorts. I'm not going to hear the end of it on Jamaica Avenue. But I have my earpods, so like it's not going to be that serious. Anyways, yeah, that's all. I also need to find some worksheets on mine to give my daughter. Go, gotta go. So I went and did my nails and it was a very positive experience, especially considering that the girl was both black and Caribbean. And even though it was inside of her apartment, it was like, as soon as you go in, so it's not like we had to venture deep into her apartment to, no so that was also good for me because that was one thing that i was kind of afraid of being like neck deep in somebody's little apartment to go do my nails so considering that that wasn't it that was good i absolutely love my nails when i go to get my nails done the problem always is that the french is never done the way how i wanted her method was a little bit different but i wasn't afraid at all because I figured if I give the Chinese people a chance so many times, the least I could do is give somebody else the opportunity to see what they do. So I loved it. I feel like she was pretty good for like a free hand. As in like drawing it on herself. Pretty, pretty good. And I definitely feel like I'm going to be going back to her because, you know, I liked the experience that I had. We had a good little conversation. Nothing was awkward. So um, that was great. No when I'm looking at them, they came out a little long. But at least I have the option to like rub it down or whatever the case is, like I could go back to her and have her fix it.